moving on to our other big story today, the search for 22-year-old Sunil Tripathi, who went missing on March 16th from the Brown University in America, is now over. Medical examiners have confirmed that the body they pulled out uh, of the Providence Harbour on Tuesday is that of Indian origin Tripathi. His identity was confirmed through a forensic medical test. However, police are yet to determine the cause of death. The family's trauma was doubled last week when online speculation surfaced that he might have been one of the two Boston Marathon bombers. In an exclusive interview to CNN's Piers Morgan, his family recalled the ordeal. Both our nuclear family and our extended family uh, had extensive contact with him, which is part of what made, makes this disappearance um, just uh, so troublesome for us and so, so um, unknown. And what's made it so much worse for you as a family is that his name was linked uh, uh, in the last week to the Boston bombings uh, without any reason whatsoever. He had nothing to do with it. Yeah, it was uh, incredibly painful for our family. This was coming at a time after 34 days of, of, of pain in our, in our family and worry. Um, and we, you know, knew unconvincingly um, that this was not Sunil, um, especially when we saw all the video footage and uh, surveillance that was being released. Uh, we were absolutely sure, and it was just very difficult to have the events of that, that night uh, unfold so aggressively um, with language that was not based on any actual evidence at all. It was an incredibly hard night. Um, between 3 and 6 a.m., we as a family received literally hundreds of phone calls. Um, and it was, uh, it was very, as well as watching our Facebook page that we've been helping uh, coordinate our search, um, just get plastered with these baseless allegations. I mean, Sangeeta, the, the horrible irony is you've been using social media so effectively to try and find out what happened to him and then this medium that has been so useful to you suddenly became uh, an implement of real torture for you and your family. Um, it's very difficult for our family. We're a very private family. It was very difficult to be so public uh, with Sunil's story and with our lives. Um, but we knew that we needed the public and we needed everybody. Um, and it was hard to see the other end of that, of that spectrum through the course of that night.